Hello and welcome everybody to the Jet Fifth Job Skill video. I do have to have a warning though. The skills are loud. I heard them just now and oh my god, they are very loud. <clears throat> I'm not going to turn it down because I want you guys to experience what I experienced. So um, yeah, the first skill is Gravity Crush. You get this when you first become Fifth Job. And the second skill is Suborbital Strike, which is the second skill that you have to get like node stones and node shards for. So Gravity Crush... I hate it. I, I hate it. I It's just... It doesn't really seem useful to me. So basically what you do is you summon a black hole that will do 500% damage on enemies that you sucked into it uh, continuously. And then if you either press the skill again or the duration runs out, it will explode into like a giant supernova, basically. Um, the thing about it is that the damage that your party does increases this skill's explosion at the end. So, it says some crazy number. Like, okay, it starts at 660% damage. Hold on a second. But, if your party does enough damage, this skill can do up to about 20,000... 20, 20, mm, 20,400 damage. Percent damage. That is... Like, the highest percent I've seen in all of Maple. Like, I... I I feel like that's a typo or something. Because that is so strong. But if it's true, please, somebody... Somebody test this for me. Like, oh my god, it's... Well, I don't know how many jets are there. Anyway. So, yeah. Uh, you summon a black hole. It stuns the enemies that get sucked in. And, um... Explodes at the end. That's pretty much what the skill does. Less for 10 seconds, and has a cooldown of 2 minutes. Suborbital Strike, much more useful. Much more... it's not party-dependent. Uh, party so you summon a drone for 42 seconds, and of course, as you level the skill, it gets, you know, a longer duration. But um, you summon a drone that will... that has two forms, um, and does damage to enemies. So, in its first form, it'll automatically spawn into the... it's called uh, Beam Splitter which is the mobbing version. It splits into, I think, four... Uh, yeah, four, um... Like, robots that will shoot at enemies around you. And they they go to the enemy that has, the, like, the most HP in range. So, um, it'll attack four enemies in that area. And, um, yeah, does four lines, pretty cool. So, the second form, if you press the skill again, it turn, it switches forms. You can only switch form every, uh, what was it, three seconds or four seconds? Uh, three seconds. So, how do I put it? Um, so when you press it again, you get, like, the, the bigger drone, which is all four of them combining into one. It actually reminds me of Ilium now that I say it. But anyway, they all go into one and attack a single target. Well, I shouldn't say a single target. They mainly attack a single target. The thing is, is that if there's other enemies around that target, they'll also be hit. So it can attack up to 10 enemies 5 times. Cooldown is 180 seconds. Pretty long, but uh, when you have it available, it's not that bad actually. It really helps in dojo. Or bossing in general. So let me go ahead and show the skills. Here's the black hole. Let me uh, find some monsters. Alright, let's do it on... Let's do it on this platform. Oh, again, warning. Very loud. Very loud. Here we go. So as you can see, it'll stun them, leave them in that area, and then at the end of the skill, it'll explode. Yeah! Alright, so, um... <laughs> the next skill, suborbital whatever it was called. Here we go. So when you summon it, it will attack, you know, a few enemies in the area. Actually, it's not as loud as it was before. Huh. Well, anyway, they just go around attacking enemies in the area. Oh my god, it's getting louder. So I think it's dependent on how many enemies are actually in the area. And then if you press it again, it then becomes this guy. Who does the same thing, but he does more damage on, you know, pretty much the single target. And that's the fifth job skills. 
kind of wish it lasted longer. I'm sure it does at max, uh, when skill is maxed, but yeah, those are the skills. <clears throat> those are the skills. Um, I guess because there was less mobs for me to attack, it wasn't as loud, so I guess volume warning denied or something. But anyway, uh, I don't even want to show it bossing, but I guess I'll have to, huh? So let me go to Von Leon, let's do Dojo, because Dojo just reset today. And let's get it done. Alright, so here we are at Von Leon. Let's go ahead and use the skills. Let's just throw the black hole over there. Make sure we summon our little guy, put him into the bossing mode. And let's take him out. Cool. I gotta say, Jets have really good looking skills. It's just too bad that they're not actually, you know, good. I really wish this class had more love uh, on Nexon's part, but it feels like they kind of forgot about them. And uh, yeah, that was Jet Bossing on pretty much Von Leon. Anything else I want to mention? Uh, again, you can, you know, change them around. And uh, yeah. I, I really have nothing else to say. So, um, thank you for watching, and hope you have a good day, night. Well, anyway, thank you again. Skills are loud, by the way. They might not have shown it in this video because I didn't have enough enemies to fight, but believe me, there are. Oh my god, if you have too many enemies. You know what? No, no, no. You know what? Before I end it, I'm gonna break your ears, like they broke mine. I'm gonna go to a map that has so many enemies. How long is this video? Almost 10 minutes? Okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna cut out the dojo run, so it'll probably end up being like 6 minutes instead. But okay, let me let me get a group of enemies, and I'm gonna show you the pain that I went through. Here we go! Oh, look at all these guys. Okay, hold on. Let's get them all down here. Alright, now we just need to wait for the skill to actually get off cooldown. Alright, you guys ready to have your ears broken? This is going to be lovely. Hold on, hold on. Oh my goodness. So loud. Why is the skill so loud compared to everything else? Why is it so much louder than every other skill? I mean, yeah, it's because there's a lot of enemies, but... Still. Like, that skill's quiet. That skill's quiet. Like, all of these skills are quiet. So why is the... <laughs> why are the fifth job skills so loud? Anyway. Thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye!